Hi, this is Robert Radcliffe and welcome back to the blog and I hope that you're finding this information useful. So as many of you know, right now is probably the best time in 20 years to purchase a home. So with that in mind, when choosing a realtor, uh, the question comes up is whether or not you should work with a realtor exclusively or not. And years ago I had an experience that taught me a very important lesson. I was representing these two clients, Kathy and Greg. and while in negotiations, uh, they were ready to sign the seller's counteroffer at this particular price. And I had mentioned to them that I sensed that I was able to go back in and renegotiate, or not renegotiate, but counter the seller's last counteroffer to get them a better price on the house. And I remember they were actually a little nervous about it. They're like, well, Rob, don't lose the house for us. And I said, guys, I assure you, I'm not going to lose this house. I will get, I think, another thirty-five to 50000 off the price. Well, I didn't get 50000 but I got 25000 off the price. And needless to say, they were unbelievably appreciative and thankful. And one of the things that dawned on me during that experience is I recognized God, I was being so, I guess, aggressive on behalf of my client. And the reason was, is I, re I remember exactly how I felt at the time. I knew that Greg and Kathy were working with me exclusively. I knew they weren't going to be listening to any other agent that called them and introduced them to a house. And I know that these people were loyal to me, and, and therefore the loyalty was extended back to them. I was going to do everything I could to get them the best possible price on that house that they were purchasing. And this was about 18, 19 years ago. It was early on in my career. And at that moment, I made the commitment to myself that I would only work with people that were working exclusively with me for that very reason. But that really is not a, a testimony of why I work with clients exclusively, but more so, I think, why you should work with an agent exclusively. The question comes up, do you want an agent, just any agent representing you on one of the largest financial transactions you're ever going to make? Do you want someone that doesn't really count you as their A client or someone that's just introducing to any home and or someone that's just trying to push you up in price just so you'll buy something and fear that if they don't sell you a home quickly, you might buy a home through another agent. That's not the type of representation you want on one of your largest financial transactions. You want to know your agent has your back. And the way you're going to have that happen is where your agent knows that you're working with them exclusively. So think about that seriously. I hope that information helps. And thanks for watching.